Hello everyone, and welcome. We're gonna try something different this time. I'm not gonna talk like this the whole time, because I don't think I can. But we're gonna try and tell some stories and focus a little less on the gameplay. But first, I'm gonna get a little pissed off. Because that's not how it happened. <laughs> I'm a very big fan of Scott Pilgrim. And that shit is totally wrong. That's a very, very abridged version of the story. Not in any way, shape, or form. See, this is right. This is true. He this is, is true. He this is, is accurate. He's in love with Ramona Flowers, but... Mm-hmm. I right. mean, there are seven evil exes. Yes, that is a thing. But mm-hmm. it, it didn't start that way. No. Anyway. And it's not ex-boyfriends. She has one girlfriend. Correct. Evil exes. Yeah. That is my fault. I am wrong. I'm very sorry. Anyway. Let us begin. Yes, let's play Scott Pilgrim. Let's play Scott Pilgrim! Where's the world of the game? Dude, fuck. I love so it. excited. Scott Pilgrim so much. Alright, so um, since all my characters are jacked up to levels, we'll do... Uh... Just rough and tough, man. I don't okay. know if I can get beyond that. Alright. I'm not that good. Uh, I'm going to press A to join. Yes! <laughs> I love Steven Stills. Uh, who do I want to play as? Steven Stills is the best. Is 16 the max level? Because everyone's at 16. Except Steven Stills! No, except, well, for you. Oh, for me. Oh, because yeah. Steven Stills is the only one I played last time. Yeah, I'll do... Steven Stills is the best. I like Kim. I'll do Kim. I was going to do Kim as well, but I like Steven Stills. You don't want to, what color do I want to be? Um, I would do Kim. You know, because isn't it the best watching people customize? It's so simple! It is! It's such an easy thing, but it's so nice! Letting people customize their characters. It is. I love it. I love it. Oh, oh Joseph's bedroom. What's that? I don't remember that part. All right, buddy. I don't know this yeah. game. You're the Go one level one. It. Go to level one. It's been a while since I played it. Ah, of course. Hi guys. Bye, Wallace. That's it's just to get familiar a little bit. Right, let's do this. Punches. Uh, oh, guard. Right. Guard right. is B. We have like heavy and light attacks. Yeah. Heavy and light. Jumps. And then uh oh, oh super attacks. Stamina is R one. Oh, and you can taunt? Yeah. Oh, no, that's uh, that's to call assist. Oh, uh, okay. Can you taunt? Oh, look at that. And then you run. Yes, okay. Nice. Let's do this. See, I am way stronger than you because I'm level 16 <laughs> and you're level 2. <laughs> what level am nine. I doing? Boom. Amazing. Alright. At the same time, my health is shit. I have 3 health right now. Why? Uh, I think because I've been playing as Kim. Last time I played this, oh. and the health doesn't stack. Wait, really? It doesn't yeah. reset? Oh, so you're now dead. Yeah, but I have four lives. It's okay. Oh, oh okay. I can come back in. That's right. What? I can, uh, re- you can do a recover. Really? Yeah. Huh. I'm gonna pick up this guy. No, I can't throw him. Boom! Alright, then. Tell me how you got into Scott Pilgrim. Oh, uh, you! Injury? You! Really? Yes. I did not know. Uh, I knew what Scott, I knew Scott Pilgrim was a thing that existed. Uh, but I did not know what it was about or what it was all like, and then I went to you in Chicago, and um, uh, then I read it. And it was good. Yeah, I enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, it's good. Okay, let's kill this jackass. We've been literally just sitting off screen this whole time. Yeah. You have sliding attacks now. Yeah. Oh, I'm down. Pick me up. I can try. Come on. Come on. Go on. Get up. Thank you. I do not imagine them being that buddy buddy. No, they're really not. I. Oh, sure, that's a pit. Yes. Cause How did you get in Scott Pilgrim? I had a roommate after my sophomore year, junior year of college, who had the first four of them. He was a great guy. Great guy. Kind of whipped by his girlfriend. But now, wife. They're married now. Oh, good for them. But, uh, I guess. I Maybe? I don't know. <laughs> I, I'm very, very much torn on this situation. But he had the first four Scott Pilgrim books, and this was before the rest of them had come out. Oh, shit! In the pit! This was before the other two had come out. That's a bus, buddy. Oh, hey! <laughs> it's Lucas Lee! And then it hits you again. Yep. Because it has to add insult to injury. Oh, I wanted to pick him up. So your, so your friend so, gave you looks? So he, he let me borrow them, and then he was broke at the time, and I was working all the time. Come help me up. I'm trying. No, you're not. I was working all the time. This is back when I would be scheduled to work 20 hours a week, and I ended up working 60. This was also back when I literally got paid to play video games. So, I mean, you can't really complain that much. Well, yeah, exactly. Because it was just 
It was just me all by myself on the weekends, and I had to answer phones, and we got maybe four phone calls a day. So I got paid to use the giant screens. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. I don't know how to get through the guard breakers in this. Uh, I think you're strong attack? I'm trying to. But anyway, I got paid to uh, use our giant projection screen TVs, that, or giant projectors that we had. So I'm playing on like a 10 by 20 giant, like a 10 feet by 20 foot giant projector. Nice. Which is amazing. And I'm just playing video games all the time. And so I had enough money, and then the next two came out. So five came out right away, and then six came out just a little bit later. Like a, yeah, like a year or so. Yeah. It, it was enough time that I was able to get both of them. And I read them all. And then the movie had come out right around the same time Six came out. Yeah, because the whole thing was that uh, the movie had a different ending than, than Six. And Six was written at the time. It was. And it was Brian Lee O'Malley specifically did not want it to have the same ending. Yeah. Well, and, and also... he didn't want to spoil it. Because the movie came out first, I think. Oh, really? Yeah, like slightly first. Well, ultimately, that's what I like about Scott Pilgrim. I mean, I was the exact target audience of Scott Pilgrim. I've seen Scott Pilgrim... In theaters, I saw it seven times. Seven? I've seen it Seven. Oh, oh, yeah. I bought it the day oh, it came up. out on DVD. Shut up. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Okay, I'm gonna beat these guys up first. I bought it the day it came out on DVD. Nope. And I have seen it there you go. all the time. Like, I, I watch it about every three months. Something like that. It's my favorite movie, but I am the exact target audience for it. Mm -hmm. The target audience is nerdy, hipster video game players who like music but aren't willing to devote any time to it. Like, I am the target audience who also like Go there. viewing the human condition. I'm trying to. Oh, it has the star on it. Oh, that's so cool. So what I like about Scott Pilgrim is that it tells a different story then, like, like the, they have two different messages. The book and the movie are not trying to get across the same message. The movie's message, or the book's message, is not everything revolves around one person. And, I don't know, I think the movie's message is that you gotta, you gotta be okay with who you are. You have to accept yourself. Mm hmm That's why he gets the sort of acceptance or whatever the hell it was. Uh, what was it? Self-respect? Yeah. Power of self-respect. Yes, the power of self-respect. That's how it goes. That's... You gotta believe in yourself. Like Naruto. Yes. Which is over. <laughs> ah! In the, like, cheesiest way possible. I've just got this giant crystal I'm gonna bash people with. What? Where did that come from? I pulled it out of the ground. Why? I don't know. I haven't been to Toronto lately, but... Oh, we can oh we can actually buy. We can pay off Scott's late fees. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I don't have the money for it. Jeez, that's a lot of late fees. Sorry, one second. Can we just like I don't whose boobs bounce that much when they're talking to someone? Uh, people who were designed by uh, right in the way. What's this guy's name? Yeah, who, who did the art for this game? Uh, shit. Look really cool that. guy. Look at that. I see it. I don't even. I can't. I've seen it. I've seen boobs. Normally, they don't work that way. Maybe in Toronto, they're different. Hey, young Neil. Oh, is that young Neil? That's, that's young awesome. Neil. Everyone is some... Or, like, if we go back, we can see that's, uh... Who was it that's back? That uh, was, uh... Whoever Aubrey Plaza's character is. Um... <laughs> if you go, best place down you up. That's, uh... Shit. Not Lisa. Um... Can we go in all these stores? Yes. Really? These are for, I think they're, uh... I want nachos. Buy some. Fuck yeah. What do you need to do? Oh, nice. I want more nachos. Of course I do. Don't, you're gonna, you're gonna spend all your money on nachos. Yeah. That's the best thing to spend all your money on. No, it's not. What? The best thing to spend your money on is the bionic arm. No. No, oh, I guess you... to punch things better. I, you can't defeat me. I have a bionic arm. Oh, uh, that's, that's that food. More, uh, health. Yeah. Power ups are in the secret shops, but I know where the secret. I know where one of them is at least. How much we play this game? Uh, I used to play it all the time. I love this game. Ugh. I guess there's no online. Let's see if I can get 64 hits in. Oh hey, is that uh? Oh, shit. Oh, I didn't think it was an actual bad guy. Yeah, look, if they're just standing there, they're not bad guys. If they actually move around, then they are. 
Oh, yeah, you got back hits, too. They got a gun. That's, uh, um, that is it's, Steven's boyfriend. Yeah, Steven's uh, what's his boyfriend, name? yep. Goodbye, Take this fat guy into the bookstore. Oh, we left. Lost at sea! What are these for? Uh, these, uh, give you, um, I, I think, upgrade your stats a bit. Oh, nice. Like, buy the 101 push-up. Let's yeah. get strong. Yeah, I think your, your, health, your stats went up. Okay, I'm done, I'm done. I'm good. Thank you. That was Lisa, I think, running the bookstore. Oh, nice. I like that you jump. Yeah, you can do dash hops. I'm gonna beat somebody to death with trash. That's, uh, that, that is, is, um, Knives' mom. Knives' mom. Boss. Woo! Out of the way. Avoided this time. In fact, I'm gonna call Knives out for assist. Nope, that's Knives' mom. Knives' is dad. Well, how do you call assists? Uh, L bumper. Go! That's Knives. But she left pretty quick. Yeah, only one at a time. Oh, wow, nice. No, oh, I have a lot of stamina. Never mind. You're gonna try what? I was, if you, uh, they all have different assists with knives. Uh, -huh. uh go jump down, jump down. Why? Because you want to go in here. Fine. Is this the secret shop? Yes. Is this where I can get a bionic arm? Yes. You can't defeat See, me. there it is. I have to nowhere near enough money for it. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Alright, well then. Oh. You didn't need to buy anything? Uh, my stats are are good, man. How can I see my stats? Status. Oh. That makes sense. Oh, I am strong like bold. Yeah, my stats are maxed how out. Do I, I am good. How do I increase my defense though? Um, probably something in the shop. Jeez. Here, you know what? You know what? Since I don't need money, yeah? uh, I'll just lend you all the money. Oh yeah, thanks, so, man. Here, go in, go in, the shop. Oh. Well, guess it glitched out a little there. Whoops. Uh here. Two loads of cash. You ever play Killing Floor? No. There is a game called Killing Floor. Go ahead. Buy, buy, uh... I'm gonna buy a buy No, no, your, your strength is high enough already. No, but... Buy a never-ending fantasy or something. Or that's speed, that's I'll probably... I'll buy both. I'll buy both. Okay, yeah. Why not? And, uh... Okay. Oh, there we go. There. See? Oh, nice. And let's buy a speed of the porcupine. Come on. I'm trying to. Nice. Speed plus 50. Okay. Nice. That's a little better. Oh, Boss! Boss! No, never mind, not a bus. Oh, sports cars! Oh, I'm down, I'm down, I'm down! But you're gonna get run over by cars! Just pick me up if I don't lose a life! Come on! Come on! There we go. Oh, never mind, the cars are done. Yeah. Boom! Anyway, Killing Floor is a... It's a... Oh, um, it's a... It's a zombie game where you kill zombies. But it's most famous for, for loads of money. For loads of money. I love that song. Oh my goodness, it's such a it's a simple fun game too. And I no wait, it is expensive. I got it for free somehow, humble bundle or something. Ah. Uh, Anybody who doesn't use the humble bundle, totally should. Totally should use humble bundle. Humblebundle.com. You can get games for cheap while supporting charity. You can't go wrong. Charity is great. Yeah. I like helping people who can't help themselves. Boom! Do this. Eh, I want to cone you. Look at look at uh, Kim freak out whenever she swings. <laughs> she loves it. Uh, where does no storm? Into the secret door. Is that the only way out? Yes. Oh. There's no progression. It's just an invisible wall back no, there. Because it uh, fits the movie at least. Yeah. Ah. Well. Here, punch these blocks though. Punch your buns. And get the money. Get the coin. Punch it fast. I'm trying to. Oh, you have to do this all at once. Yeah. Oh, uh, nice. I didn't know. Do coins go away? Yes. Oh. So get all the coins you can with the moose on it. Let's do this. Ah! Oh. Yeah. But it's like Mario where if you just leave it sitting, it'll burn out. Uh -huh. And then you won't get any coins at all. Oh. You're, no, okay, yeah, we can still get it. Where is that one? It's above. Oh. Uh, seriously. How did they convince Steven Stills to get in on this? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> well, can... everyone has a different ending, a different reason for doing this. Oh, and Steven, okay. uh, gets the best band in the world for doing it. Oh, uh, okay. That makes sense. Oh, hey. It's Crash and the Boys. Yeah. 
Is that the one band with Crash? And those boys? <laughs> those boys. Or Steven again. Or not Steven, uh, Wallace. Ah, uh, nice. Yep. His powers are mystical. I thought he was a pirate. He's just super easy, though. I think we, we like, we pretty much are. Oh! To just, like, get him in an infinite loop or something? Yeah. Alright, well, I'm just gonna sit here drinking. Oh, he got his demon hipster chicks. Yeah, knives! Oh. Jeez, does it, like, cost- Oh, shit! We can't hurt him without killing the demon hipster chicks. Exactly. The game trying to! Punch him the back! Oh, oh, he's got infinite guard. I think we got him. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Nice. All right, where's my bear? All right. And he turns into uh, what was it? Two fifteen? I'd like, yeah. Not enough for bus I don't even fare. remember. The cups don't do damage, by the way. Well, all that matters is that I have one. Because <laughs> I just pretty much sat back and let you do everything. See. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. You only got 11 more. Rating pass. Haha, <laughs> you suck. What? There's only two of us. Aww. I love that the little fade away. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Alright, I'd love to. Tell a story. Um, hmm. Uh, What's in between? Oh, you can just. Those are just points in the map. Okay. Been. Tell us an embarrassing story. Um, oh, embarrassing. embarrassing. I don't have any embarrassing Here, stories. Here, I'll, I'll for me. let you. I'll give you some time to prepare. Uh, I'll tell my own embarrassing story. Go ahead. I was a child. I was, let's say, maybe ten. Did they just attack us with? Flash. Yeah, the flashes blind you. They're annoying. Anyway, you're a child. Anyway, I was like ten, maybe eight, young, young enough that I shouldn't have been expected to do this on my own, and my family went to Niagara Falls. For whatever reason, I had to take a poop, but nobody wanted to wait for me. And so, oh wait, what's in the bag? What's in the? I want to go in the wagon. Oh, it's just more food. No, yeah. never mind. They have poutine though. That's Lisa and one of Lisa's friends. Oh, nice. I'm gonna beat people to death with this broom. Anyway, you were you had to poop. I had to poop, but nobody wanted to go That's with like me. Right, by the way. For some reason, I don't know. I was just set on fire. Holy shit. I'm gonna beat the crap out of this tank. Wait, is this the story where you got lost in the woods? I didn't get lost, no, but I, uh, I so I had to poop, and eventually, like, they're just like, go back to the bathrooms. And go to the bathroom. I'm just like, um, I I'm eight, but I can give it a try, sure. I'll do what I can. And I am, like, halfway there. And then I'm just like, I can't take it anymore. So I have to find my way. Do we need to beat him up? No. Get back here. Get back here. Um, so I, I just walk into the forest. Like, I go, like, 500 feet into the forest. Enough that I can see people on the trails, but not enough that, like, people can really tell what I'm doing. And I just pull down my pants and take a dump. Just right in the woods. And it gets everywhere. Everywhere. All over your pants? Everywhere. And then some guy, like, sees me crouching in the woods. And doesn't, like, tell anybody. Just, like, stares and then just walks away. Accepts it. There's just a kid crouching in the middle of the woods. No parents around. Nobody else is nearby. And he's just like, you know, this is a thing that happens. This is a normal thing that happens. And then walks away. Eventually, my parents come back, and I'm still hiding in the woods, in shame, covered in poop. <laughs> and eventually, like, oh, I don't know. Jeez. Oh, we do? Yeah. Oh, good. <laughs> I've hit every single one so far. I do not have double jump. Oh, uh, you I don't. have now hit every single one of them. You have not unlocked double jump yet. Whew! Every single one. You were going to have to revive me in three hits. Well, you can bash with the key. Yep. Keyblade. So you poop and your parents find you. No, they don't. I am hiding in the woods. Motherfucker. I am hiding in the woods and then eventually I just get ashamed and go track them down. Covered in feces. And my mom spends a good 
10, 15 minutes just going, it's everywhere! <laughs> it's everywhere! <laughs> it was bad. It was bad. It's probably my second most embarrassing moment. Second? Second most embarrassing moment. What could top that? I uh, was in fifth grade, I remember this very well. I was in fifth grade, I wanted to put the key in the chest. Too bad. Get all that money and then break that thing because there's a crushing wall coming for us. Oh, really? That was pretty simple. I don't think that was the threat it was supposed to be. Yeah. You were in third grade. You pooped um, yourself grade. again? Fifth grade. No, I yourself? was in fifth grade. And uh, we had to do a... We had to pick a region or an area or country and we had to write a report on it. I got Argentina. Fuck you, Edgar Wright. Eat a dick. Get back here. Anyway... Uh, I had uh, I, I did Argentina, and I did a report on Argentina, and I had to find a political map of Argentina. Okay, what I thought a political map was, I thought it was a map that shows where the different political parties are set up inside the country. That's not what a political map is. No. A political map just shows you the boundaries of the country. That's all you needed to find. And this was back... Google was a thing, but it was still in, an in, in its infancy. So I can't say, like, oh, I just went to Google, and it showed me everything I needed. Oh, hey, help me out, buddy. Shit. Sorry, this guy's in my way. Come on. Come on, get up, you stupid ass. <laughs> so I flipped the fuck out. At this point, I was a straight-A student, like, teacher's pet. All I ever had was good grades, and I could not find this one map. And so, I'm so worried that I'm gonna fail, and, like, my dad is like, if you can't finish this report, you're not allowed to carve your pumpkin. It was, it was Halloween time. Oh, boy. So I didn't get to carve my pumpkin, because I couldn't find a political map, something that doesn't exist! <laughs> and I couldn't find it. <laughs> oh, young Neil, what are you doing here, buddy? Powers, look him up on the web. So I couldn't find a political map. And eventually, like, I just say, screw it, and I just grab a map of Argentina, and this is weeks, like, this is two weeks later, like, the, the reports do, and I'm just like, I can't, I just have to suck it up and go just deal and just print the report <laughs> and whatever. And the very next day, we turn in our report, and the very next day, well, that's much less intimidating than I thought it was, yeah. the very next day... The teacher assigns another report. The very next day, she assigns another report. And I freak out. <laughs> Full-blown panic attack. I crawl under my desk and start crying. Just sobbing. I think at this point we can afford to up the difficulty a little bit. As a five-year-old kid, I'm just sitting under my teacher's desk, sobbing. <laughs> In, in fifth grade, when you already don't have friends, that does not make you any. No, that's no not... No one was like, I want to hang out with the guy who had a nervous breakdown and cried under the teacher's desk. No one. No, that's not that's not how things go. How do we up the difficulty? Uh, that see. was my most embarrassing moment. Well, since I already beat the game, I'm just going to quit out. No! And then All set it to high and then pick up at level three. All of our unsaved progress will be lost, though. And again. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go... Let's go, uh... This one! Seriously! Changing okay. colors is just a simple thing, but it adds so much enjoyment to the game. i go red right It's so simple. I love it. All it is is palette swaps. Nope. Oh, shit! Wrong one. Sorry, my bad. Anyway, so you cried under your desk? Oh, that forever? was, yeah. Oh, yeah. I cried under my desk, and then I got sent to the counselor's office. And, um... The counselor... Judged me. And, like, somehow made it like it was my fault. And, um... Yep. Yeah, that was, a uh, That was it? Okay, great, so here's your attack, Great start by the way. to my year. So er, you don't have the double attack, you don't have evade. No, but I can grapple people. Yep, and you don't have all the other stuff. Oh, I get double... Oh, double attack. Yeah. Yep. So, that, that was my interesting you. story. Um... Oh, this song is... This game has the best music. Yeah. This this level here. That's oh, a kit. That's a kit. That's a kit from. That's a kit limousine. Yeah. 
Oh, hey, that's Wallace's his boyfriend still. Yeah. He is everywhere. Uh, what's his name? Mobile. Mobile. I do not remember his name. It's Mobile. Hey, what? Glad hit nice. I like how the drummer has a robot arm. Mm -hmm. They didn't need to do it, but they did. And I like it. Uh, so, hmm, what embarrassing story do I have? I should have thought of some. I have a brick. No! Can we defeat them? Yes. Really? <laughs> no, no, not you! Only me! <laughs> By throwing bricks at them! <laughs> oh, if you hold down your heavy attack, it uh, grabs them. Alright, look at that guy. He looks suave. Oh, I probably shit. shouldn't have went with the black shirt, because now I look like everyone else. <laughs> I can't find myself in there. When I had the bright yellow shirt, I knew who I was. Oh no! I'm down! No! I'm coming! Come on! Get up! No! Sorry, Press, try one of your ultimate attacks. I'm down. Never mind. Wait, you got me! Yeah! yeah! That's my ultimate attack. That takes a little bit, of little bit of health out or uh, oh, stamina. Now but... I'm down. Save me! Get up, you lazy ass! Yeah, they're just standing around like jerks. Come on, nice. No, you went the wrong way. So, uh... look, at him. look at him being a baby. What is this? I don't know. I don't have many. Like lo length, embarrassing stories. Really? There were a lot of times that I cried in grade school. Yeah, who did? And crying is not appropriate when you're a boy in grade school. Who didn't? Especially over dumb shit like not getting the right wrestling action figure when I wanted to play wrestling action figures. <laughs> awesome. You can handle that. Boom! Oh, that was cool. That's it was. I cried about not getting pizza when someone brought in pizza to Latchkey. Latchkey is awful, by the way. I never had the pleasure. Is it bad? It's awful. What's so bad about Latchkey? Um, for one thing, yeah, I'm just... you are you have to get up early. Let's go. Oh well, yeah. Oh, it's um, just food. What's a concert T-shirt? Let's see. I mean, the stats will. If you press it, any of the stats will show you what they are. I'm just pocket. Here's the gap. And a concert. Oh, defense. There you go. Perfect. Nice. And uh, let's buy a concert t-shirt. Sure. I like the Clash of Demon Head. Alright, back They're up. I'm gonna buy some stuff too. Basically, Muse. Or metric. Metric. Yes. Uh, that's the right way. Yes. Oh, that's that's the right L I wanted. I wanted, uh... I mean, why? Yes. Uh, it's the healing item. Is that health? That's hard points, yeah. I want... My GP to go up, so that I can actually do special attacks. What's the GP? Uh, it's your, like... <laughs> All cool people have at least one. Is he still down here? Yeah, he doesn't go away. Really? Yeah. Hey, Lisa. I love beating people to death with their friends. It's a very rewarding experience. Seriously, I do not remember her in the comics at all. Lisa? This bitch. Lisa, yeah. Yeah. You don't remember Lisa? Did, like, describe when she came up. Uh, in volume f uh, four or five, she uh, was one of Scott's exes. Oh. And uh, she came back to town for a little bit uh, when Scott was, like, having weird points with Ramona. Oh. And it was a big deal that he didn't, like, they were broken up sort of at the time. Mm -hmm. And Lisa was hitting on him and he didn't go for it. And that was, like, his realization that he loved Ramona. Huh. That's fun. Yeah. There's a lot of guys now. Wow. I like uh, it. Well, it's because we're on the hard difficulty. Yeah. No shit. He took me out. He bitch slapped me. Eh, get back here. So why is Latchkey bad? Uh, because you have to get up early. Keep going. Yep. Uh, there's, like, no one you really know in Latchkey. Did you meet people? I guess no. it's hard for Not me. To meet people. I never met people. What? You're not the standard awkward child? I was totally the standard awkward child. <laughs> what was the thousand fist slap there? She's awesome that way. Kim Pine is awesome. Were they already dead? Yes. They're already dead because Kim beat them up already. 
This game's awesome that way. Oh no, Kim! Get up! There you go. Uh... Oh. Ah. Oh jeez, that's oh, a ton of guys. Oh look at all of them! Ah, that's amazing! Come on, knives! Look at all the cows! Uh. Oh no! Come on, stand the hell up. Oh, that's how you do it. You yeah. Ride right bumper. No, I might go down soon. I'll get you. Oh, oh. We just broom everything. Oh, snap. We might have dog. Yeah. Hold on one second. No, no. 